there. Today we're going to talk about the difference between a hanger stake and skirt stake. This one right here is the hanger stake and this is a skirt stake. Actually it's about half of one skirt stake. Both of these are I would say underutilized cuts of beef and they're both the kind of cut if you're interested in them you probably have to get from your butcher. I've never really seen this sitting out in a package shrink wrapped in the refrigerated case with all the strip steaks and the ground beef. Hanger steaks are a little bit smaller as you can see this is since this is half it would be about here and in a on a cow there's one hanger steak and there's actually two skirt steaks. They both are very uh, tender. We're going to cook them basically the same way, but I just wanted to show you what the difference was between them. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to make our marinade and we're going to put in some canola oil. We've got about a quarter cup. There we go. Put that in. And then we're going to add in our seasonings. So we got some fresh ground pepper. We're going to about two tablespoons. We're going to put a lot of this plain old ground pepper. There you go. And then obviously salt. There you go. About one teaspoon of ground cinnamon. We're going to put a little bit of paprika, about half a teaspoon. Color. About the same amount of thyme. Some thyme. Onion powder. Put that in. Half a teaspoon of garlic powder. A little bit of ground cumin. I'm going to stir this around a little bit. Get the spices together. And we're going to add in some minced garlic. Some lemon juice. This is a half a lemon from another recipe. We use that. I'm also going to zest one lemon. Lemon is a great flavor enhancer. And then we'll use the juice from this once we've gotten the zest off. And as I'm sure you've heard on TV, zest is free flavor. You should use it whenever you can. And from the lemon we just zested, take the juice. Alrighty. So we'll stir this. The lemon and the garlic combined with the spices. What we'll do is we'll take our skirt steak. We'll put it in a plastic bag. So we put both skirt steak and the hanger steak in. We pour the marinade in. Zip this up. We'll let this marinate for about a half an hour in the fridge and then we'll take it out to the grill. All right we've had the skirt steak and the hanger steak marinating and we're going to open up our grill give it a quick brush we're gonna have the grill do double duty today not only do we have our our hanger steak and our skirt steak we have some sweet potato fries and with these sweet potato fries we have a sriracha dipping sauce, and that's featured in our e-cookbook volume one sauces, which you can download for free at our website, cookingsecretsformen.com. So we'll put the meat on first. See the skirt steak is a little thinner than the uh, hanger steak, so it'll cook a little quicker. Put it at a 45 degree angle. So there's great grill marks. I'm going to put the uh, sweet potato fries on the other side. And all we're trying to do is get some grill marks on these because they were already parboiled. We'll close the lid for just a minute. Okay, these will cook pretty quickly. So we're going to turn the flank steak. And the skirt stick. Nice grill mark on them. Come over here and turn the sweet potatoes. 
Uh, see the grill marks on them? That's all we're doing is just getting some some marks on them because they're already cooked. And those sweet potatoes won't take much longer. All right, let's check the hanger steak with our meat thermometer. All right, so it's maxing out at about 111, 112. So we got another minute or so. That skirt steak is done. We'll pull that off. Obviously, the meat has to rest. So while the hanger steak is finishing, we're going to take our sweet potatoes, sweet potato fries off. And as you can see, there's beautiful grill marks on those sweet potato fries. So the hanger steak is at between 120 and 125. Very beautiful. Nicely done on the grill. So we're going to take these inside, slice them, and get ready to serve. Alright, so we have both of our steaks. The hanger steak right here and the skirt steak. So the hanger steak, uh, I much prefer larger pieces, not paper thin. So that's the end. But well, you can see, nice, nicely done. And we're going to serve this on plate with our sweet potato fries. And this is a sriracha dipping sauce. Just put a little bit on the side. And there you have it. Serve with a little bit of fresh asparagus. We're going to serve with the sweet potato fries and the dipping sauce. And this is our hanger steak. So for the skirt steak, more want to cut that on a bias because it's uh, a little bit thinner. So we're kind of coming at a 45 degree angle. Perfectly done. So that is the difference between skirt steak and hanger steak. Both are delicious, same part of the cow. Two pieces of skirt steak on each cow, one hanger steak. You can't go wrong, but you gotta ask the butcher. So appreciate everybody. Thanks to all our subscribers. Thanks to everybody who takes the time to comment and like our videos. We certainly do appreciate it. So until next time, thanks for watching.